classic sitcom Steptoe and Son has become embroiled in Amy 2 style sleaze row. Actress Caroline Seymour said there was inappropriate and out of control behavior as she did a striptease for the spin off 1972 film, and she stormed off set. The storyline centered around Harold Steptoe, Harry H. Corbett, meeting nightclub stripper Zeta, played by Carolyn, much to the displeasure of Harold's father Albert, Wilfred Brambell. Caroline revealed that a group of medical students were hired as extras. But she claimed their conduct was so appalling that she refused to film any more scenes. And she told producers they could sue her as there was no way I was going back. Carolyn, now 74, said, the director, Cliff Owen, had put wine on the tables and encouraged the students to drink because he wanted them to be boisterous and a bit lewd. He would have been mortified by how it all turned out because he was a good man, just weak. But we had a woman producer in Aida Young and she was a nightmare, not interested in what was happening in front of her. Eventually, the cameramen managed to halt the chaos. But had the Me Too movement been around, I would have had a very solid case. I had a couple of small scenes still to do, which they fudged. Caroline made her revelations in You Dirty Old Man, a biography of Bran Bell. She added, I adored Wilfred but Harry seemed almost suicidal, he was so miserable. Bran Bell, 72 died from cancer in 1985 while Corbett, 57, passed away from a heart attack in 1982. Four series of Steptoe and Son were shown by the BBC in black and white from 1962 to 1965 and in color from 1970 to 1974. It was watched by more than 28 million viewers at its peak. You Dirty Old Man. The authorized biography of Wilfred Branbell, by David Clayton, is out now.